salient plates in the North Central region, which comprises of seven states. I am Mr. Benry, the food basket of the nation. I am Mr. Kwara, the state of harmony. I am Mr. Akogi, the conference state. I am Mr. Ninja, the power state. I am Mr. Abuja, the center of unity. I am Mr. Platsu, a state known for peace and tourism. Nasarawa, home of solid minerals. As our region rebel, our wounds swell. Whispering the pain like a caged bird. Enslaved by insecurity, poverty, and communal crisis. Idomo Ladam, my father's land, has turned to a land where farmers are now afraid to till the soil and produce produce. Leading to poverty as a result of insecurity caused by the Fulani Hetzin and the farmers' headers crisis. Characterized by mass atrocities such as brutal killing, rape, dismissal, kidnapping, destruction of livelihood. Making us homeless, living like church rats, the future of our children destroyed. June 2015 to April 2016, the headsman has killed over 710 Nigerians, including the Agota incident with over 48 recording incidents. Hundreds killed, thousands displaced between 2013 and 2021 in Plato and Nasarawa state, more ongoing incidents till date. Our neighboring brothers, blinded by greed, hate, and jealousy. With a nice small arms, fight and attack their brothers, leading to the massacre of innocent victims. Religion has divided us. Wealth has classified us. Politics has separated us. Our government has abandoned us. As we cry freedom from our hanging cross with nails, chained and our garments soaked with blood. With strength from within, we rise above. Our voices, united, we make a stand for justice, quality, and in hand. As we call on our government to set up a committee where religious leaders and intellectuals of the seven states can dialogue and promote peace region-wide. Reliable security services, creation of jobs, and the promotion of intercommunal marriages is an approach to rid of these salient plagues in the North Central region. In solidarity, we will break the chain. Shatter the silence. Release the pain. In the face of darkness, we will always be a beacon of hope and unity. <laughs>